That's not a good sound. Looks like rain. So what what went wrong in there? Dead. And the guy was never even any ghost. She's a pest out, and now she's free. That's bad. Oh right. Well, yeah, lifted the curse of Fike Isles one way to put it. And we put it everywhere else. Can I just smack some fucking rats? There, Annabelle's dead now. The end. I saved the day. You're welcome, everybody. Well, I guess I can take his stuff. He's not gonna need it anymore. What's that say? Oh, he had a shrine to her. And I can't- I'm, like, stuck looking at it the wrong way. A girl in plated flowers looks like a small shrine. Can I look at other things? Oh, that's just the- that's just the- that's just candles. Okay, well... Now he's dead. I'm sure that'll make me very popular in town if someone notices. No one noticed me. No one noticed me. Sorry. I didn't mean to. Alright, turn- It turns out that, uh... Having the option, I don't trust you, was a valid- was a valid thing. Although I didn't really want to pick it just because it ex- I didn't want to pick it just because it existed, necessarily, because... It's kind of- it's almost cheating, like, well the- Well, the game gives me the option, and then, like, just have my suspicions spawn from there. Because I wasn't necessarily suspi suspicious until I saw that- that- that option to have, uh, Geralt be suspicious. And that's kind of a backwards play to way to roleplay. I saw the option, so I roleplayed that way. No, that's not the good way to go. Let's go take a look at the so people in here. Six you didn't bring the hell in his eye. How to use it. No wonder he cursed us. I were doomed. In hell in his eye? What's the hell in his eye? Soured wine. Curse is your fault as much as mine. An illusion. Where's the illusion? Is this the eye, right? Samun? Not something else. Wh oh, right. Never mind. I forgot that the, uh, the illusion thing isn't an item I have to select. Alright, well, what are you guys yelling about? What are you doing here? What? This sun flying from the moon? We're making offerings to the All God, clearly. You too can seek his aid. That's if you got fit in offerings. He scorned ours. Then curse the old village. The All God, you call him. First I've heard. Is some new deity? Nay, it is ancient, revered by our forefathers. They say it were like this. Roslav of Oriton came here to gather brushwood. And suddenly, for no reason, a bush burst into flame. Then, Roslav heard a voice from the ground. Demand an offerings and obedience. We've been coming here since then, bearing gifts, in exchange for which the All God watches over us, keeps us from evil. Mm hmm. Plain to see that. So, what's wrong with your offerings? You needn't mock us. You can see right well we brought scraps. For the war, I wouldn't give this such to me elms. But what can we do? Such are the times, and they're like to get worse. All God said if he don't get a rafter of bacon and a barrel of beer at least, the rivers will fill up with frogs and locusts or some such will devour the harvest. I could intercede on your behalf with this All God of yours. Got a feeling we'd come to an understanding. Well, I suppose it can't hurt to try. To speak with him, you have to stand before the altar and cry out, All God, help a poor wretch in need. Who knows, he might just listen to a foreigner. Oop. Let's take a look really quick here. A greedy god. This is probably gonna be a lot like Fether from, I mean, I mean, it's probably gonna be a lot like Harmony, Harmony, or Harmony from, uh, Broken Age. Might as well take a look while it's here. Suggest, suggested level 7? That's close enough. Alright. Silly Geralt, if you, you can't just expect people to say that their god is new. Everyone's always gonna be like, no, it's an ancient god, of course it is. Oh, all god, help a poor wretch in need. Pretty please. How dare you disturb my divine rest, mortal? I dare disturb it because I want your divine self to lift the, uh, curse you cast. Those peasants really don't have. They must bring worthy offerings or they shall face drought. 
driving hail, earthquakes, avalanches. I have spoken. Avalanches? Here? <laughs> How would that work? No answer from the All God. Fine. We can finish our conversation when I find him. Voice came from underground. Yeah, I figured as much. It's someone manipulating people, obviously. There's a tunnel that go comes up to the altar from down there somewhere. Relatively straightforward. Let's look for that uh, hidden wall that I can open up. Using my great power. What's that red thing over there? The scratch? The weird crevice? But he's clearly just manipulating people. A crack. Too small to pass through, but big enough for sound to come out. But of course, no one's ever going to admit that their gods are new, because everyone's god has to be revered and ancient from the before times, and everyone else is wrong and has new fake gods and stuff. What do we... let's see. My character was already reacting to having some kind of... ooh. These look like a- ooh, make a I can make my own Velen Long Swords, which I don't want to make. Oh well. More alcohol and stuff. I need to look for that secret wall. My character noticed it right away, so it's gotta be somewhere around here. An object that's in a- ooh, there- is it down there? What's down there? Hmm. Wine. More like vinegar. Someone drank it anyway. Could follow the scent. Oh. Where's it gonna lead me? There we go. That'll lead me to the illusion right away. Then we're set. Oh god, what's all this? Oh. Pile of rocks. That's just all fake. Oh, that's right where I landed. That's why my character noticed it right away. Let's see here. Let's look into torches real quick. I don't necessarily know how they work, but I keep getting more, I think. Torch. Equip. In my pockets. Oh, there we go. Because I keep going into dark areas with no torch. Let's see here. Ta-da! Now, do you have a timer, Torch? Or do I just have one all the time? I'm not sure. I've seen a stack of five of them before, so I, th I assume that they run out eventually. Howdy, y'all. You, everyone have a good time around here? Ooh, loot. I think I'll have this. You don't deserve it anyway, you're just taking it from people. I'm trying to save the world and stuff. No, I'm not. I'm just I'm just a lowly witcher. What? Who dares disturb my divine being? Geralt of Rivia. Pleasure. Huh. <laughs> Expected they all got to be corporeal in form, but never thought he'd be corpulent. Fattened up nicely at those peasants' expense. Expense? Expense? Not a word about the help I give in return. Blessings, absolutions, enlightened advice. Believe me, these folks need all of it. I'd wash over them still if they fulfilled their end. But lately they offer these pathetic scraps. That they steal from the mouths of their children. And to make matters worse, you cast a curse on them. And I'll not lift it till they bring me worthy offerings. I'm to settle for curds and whey. Not a chance. And you can tell them that. Giving advice for money? That's one thing. But, uh, putting a curse on them when they when they don't play a wet long fine enough? That's a problem. Been in this hole long? For a century or so. One winter I found shelter here. Built a fire so large, the flames let through the crack, lit the bushes above. I coughed from the smoke, and suddenly heard a peasant. A voice out of nowhere, he called. A miracle. Thus, I became a god. Parasite, more like. Maybe so. But what of Freya and the little a, then, hmm? Demanding prayers and offerings, given naught in return. I talk at least. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to threaten him. Yeah, settle for humble offerings or die. He can get, he can keep his little ruse where he like gives advice for free food, but I'm not gonna have him cursing people. Listen here, lard ass. You're gonna be satisfied with what you get, or I'll feed you to the ravens. 
Darwin reformers. No, fine, fine. I'll sup more modestly. But just till the end of the war, not one day longer. Yeah. A little bit of experience real quickly. So much for acquired level. If I don't have to fight him, then I guess it's not really a thing. Now I'm just gonna go take some shit from you because I am completely immune to the morals that I spout. Because I'm a dick. Ooh. New thing to read. The Heart Slog to Greatness. Is that like his motivational novel? I really would hope to find more, uh, Alkahest. And that's all of these things. Oh, they're, they're Alkahest. Cool. That's what I need to recover my, uh, all of my consumables. I'll be very disappointed with you if you, uh, betray my goodwill. I'm I'm letting you continue your, your, your freaking dark, manipulative, uh, situation here under the assumption that you're not gonna keep cursing them like a dick. Alright guys, how you doing? Anything new? Talk to your old god, face to face. And? Will he show us mercy? He will. Promise to be pleased with whatever you bring. <laughs> I told you! I told you the All God's merciful understanding. Thanks, Witcher. Uh, I probably shouldn't mention what's down there. They might get themselves killed. Farewell. The All God show you favor. They are most certainly not equipped to fight that kind of creature. Yeah! I'm glad I stopped by for that really quick. That was a really quick little quest. We'll go right back to the tower full of mice on our quest back towards Fike Isle. I definitely do less jump cuts in this series than I used to do in Dragon Age Inquisition just because like it's just better dis- all the stuff in this game is just kind of better distributed. As you proceed around an area it's like, oh cool, there's another thing here. Another thing. Oh man, there's so many things. Where Inquisition was like, here's the quest area. Alright, now go run around killing everything. And like, well time for backtracking. There's more jump cuts. So th th they definitely they definitely nailed something about their world distribution in a way that uh, I don't think Elder Scrolls or Dragon Age games have nailed up to this point. Hey guys, don't really want to fight you. Get out of my way, get out of my way, get out of my way. There we go. We're coming up on our uh, quest objective now. It's within a hundred steps. Looks like I would have been there by now if I'd just gone straight there. But I'm taking sort of, I'm sort of following the path. Yep. Alright, mage, sorceress, whatever they're called in this universe. I get mixed up a little witch. Well, she's just pretending to be a witch though. She's not really a witch, right? So Alright, get on up. Right back to looting all of her uh, garden stuff that apparently grew back already. She's really good. It's almost as if she's magic. I know, spoilers, right? Alright. I did your objective. Everything went terribly. I let out a horrible curse. It basically made everything worse by showing up, so... Uh, everyone's gonna be really fond of us now, is what's gonna happen. You might want to run, like, far away. Geralt! Just when I was starting to miss you. Tell me more about this mage from the Isle. Were you two close? Never expected you'd take such an interest in my private life. More interested to know if you bonded, as fellow magic practitioners. Oh, we had little in common in that arena. Oh, Alexander was one of those anxious experimenters, forever short on sleep. The kind that thinks perfect happiness is an isolated tower and a full set of vials and alembics. Fike Isle's free of its curse. And you withheld this news until now? Why? I gave you a Xenovox. But the curse, what was its source? The dark spell clung to the spirit of Annabelle, the Lord's daughter. To free her and the Isle, Graham, her beloved, had to help me. So it ended well. Hmm. I lifted the curse so the island's clear. Annabelle's soul is free. Thing is, turned out she's a pesta. Graham's dead. And you failed to notice? You're losing your touch. Be that as it may, Fike Isle is free of its curse. That's important. I'm almost inclined to say good work. One thing's bothering me. What? Annabelle said Alexander was studying diseases. She mentioned Catriona. You knew this? All the mages knew about it. 
Alexander was a highly regarded epidemiologist. I would have given anything for an opportunity to study his notes, but he guarded them jealously. The lamp. What do you want to do with it? As I said, you may keep it. I don't believe I shall need it anymore, given the aisle's been cleansed. I actually regret not going there with you. Perhaps we can make up for that lost time now. All right. Time I was on my way. Perhaps... perhaps you'd stay just a bit longer? There's one small favor you might yet do for me. What is it? I put in an order for a few substances from Novograd. The trader was due to be here yesterday, but has yet to arrive. Could you see what happened? The package is rather important to me. Why not? If he was coming here from Novograd, he must have passed through Blackbow. I'll check the area. Thank you. I shall be ever so grateful. If we have a history, I might as well invest time into looking around into your situation, more so than a lot of the other options that are just random peasants I don't know. And are frankly going to get in their own trouble anyway. Favor for a friend. Take a look at the quest level for it real quick. Secondary quest, favor for a friend, level 6. Okay, cool. So we're looking for a missing shipment now. I'll look into this. How far away are we looking at? Oh, cool, it's even nearby. Come on, a roach. Hop on here. I got a decent reward earlier, didn't I? Yeah, I'm already on my way to level 6. I'm up to 400 gold. I think I got 50 crowns a second ago. Just gonna take off my custom marker that's no longer doing anything. There we go. And we're headed towards... Oh, we're headed up north. Into an area that I have ill-explored up to now. So, it, so on top of being a side quest, it'll also be a nice opportunity to clear out more, uh... It'll gather me some more nice waypoints along the way that allow me to get to such areas much more quickly in the future. Let's ride. I'll just sort of go straight towards the waypoint. I don't need... we don't need roads around here. Oh, there's a lot... wow, that's a lot of red dots. That's a lot of red... ooh. What's over here? Oh my god, what is that? Oh no, there's spider people. That's unpleasant. Well, what's the I what's the uh, the icon mean? It's like two boxes on top of each other. Uh, filters. Guarded treasure. Well, I'm level six. I don't know if I can take a whole bunch of level nines. Maybe look into that treasure later. Good to add to the map, at least. All right, so somewhere around here we have an, we have the uh, a missing transport. Oh, could it be that thing that was hung in the waypoint? Because that's always a good sign. Now those are old bodies. All right, Witcher sense activate. Ooh, wagon trails. Those are good. Those are helpful. And I can check it out without getting off. That's also nice. Oh, they end right here. And there's stuff around here. Get off the horse. There we go. Is that a water hag? Let's see here. Connect, teleconnected blast. Now let's use uh let's use let's use our upgraded Igni. It's more powerful now. Hey lady! Ow! Fuck. Fucking rude. Get out of here. Ow. Oh, she did not take much damage from that a blast. Ah, okay. This is an all-around bad approach to the fight, isn't it? Blowing things up. Shit. Dudes can do damage, can't they? You have to be careful about this. Nope. Ah, crap. What? I tried to roll away. And I completely got stuck somehow. Oh well. Death comes swiftly. Fucking horse. Get off the horse. Get off, get, get off the horse. There we go. Alright. So, some, some of you get a little frustrated by my lack of variety with spellcasting, but... I think after what happened there, you can kind of see why I like to cast my uh, shield spell so often, because man, it's easy to just take, keep taking hits in this game. So it's really handy to be able to be like quickly be like, nope, I'm going to quickly deflect damage. Oh, see? Snuck up behind me and hit me. But I didn't take any real damage because I had my shield up. And now I can fight her one-on-one. -on -one. Uh oh oh, we have a bandit. Is it a bandit? Ow, shit. That's rude. Casting shield spell with my... And I have adrenaline point to cast another one. Don't attack my horse. How dare you. I will end you, you very high hit point character. It's a good thing that the strong combo really knocks her out. Alright, new bestiary entry. Water hags. 
That'll probably be handy. So where's this bandit? Just gonna hang out, dude? Just kinda have a grand old time over there? I'm gonna start hitting you now, and I don't know when I'm gonna stop. You could give up now. Nope. Alright, gonna keep going. What you got on you? You got anything on you? Please? Why am I, st am I still in combat? There we go. I wanna see what he's got. Amateur armor repair kit. Oh, cool. I can use that for repairs. That'll be handy. Can I pick up these marshmallow mushrooms? There we go. Check out the, uh, the mother's body. And now that I have it in the beast area, I can look at more clearly at what her weakness is if I want to. D Ducal water. But more importantly, let's look at the, uh, yep, there's the shipment, probably. Cotton. Looks like they must have hit that, uh, drowner and, and derailed. Or toppled over. That doesn't really show me where the, where the, uh, ship ended up, though, does it? Are those enemies over there red? Huh. We'll take a look down here on the, on the shore. Is that moss? Blood moss. Of all the things to see reoccurring and stuff, it, is blood moss in some way a real thing? What's fighting over there? Hey buddies, you were all red. Oh wait, our enemies just always red? <laughs> I may have made a mistake just now. I'm gonna start hitting you now. Yeah! Oh. Nope. Very- Oh no! Impolite. Do not appreciate your approach to the situation. Up. Oh. There we go. Sparing use of strong attacks mixed with backwards dodges. Cleaving a few fools in two. Yeah. This is working for me. Two, wow. Combo. Alright. Now you're all alone. I can just keep hitting you. Down you go. Give me your experience. Are you even worth experience? I don't actually know. Monster Claw. More things. There we go. Drowner Brain. I can, I can ignite this. Yeah. Alright. That accomplished a lot. So maybe I'm just going about this the wrong way with these tracks. Do I have to check the other direction, perhaps? Oh, I have to examine them. That's what that's that's the step I'm missing. I was trying to follow them. Wide heavy wheels. A merchant's wagon. That's it? Huh. Maybe I'm supposed to follow them in the opposite direction then. That seemed like the right place to go. There's a fast travel spot. So where did you go from here? Oh, you're going off the road. That's always a bad sign. Where did you end up? That's the wheel. You lost a wheel. That's also a bad sign. Could I investigate something there? Oh, that's just the tracks in general. That's fine. Oh, they, they kept going. Veered off the road at high speed. Doesn't bode well. They must have been attacked by bandits and taken off the road and probably crashed as they went this way. Here we go. They're not even showing up on what- weird. They're not getting highlighted. Yeah, merchant traveling across Velen alone. No way that was gonna end well. All the marks stopped being highlighted on my screen, but they're still on the map at least, so I can follow that. Spectre dust. Old goat hide. White beard, boar hide. Dustovers, cuts of meat, cataplepis. Wonder what spell requires that. A dry red from Zubaran. Southern slope. Notes of black currant and citrus. Ah, pains the heart. Maybe she just needed food? Package still intact. Don't sense anything magic, though. Wonder how Kira will explain this one. Human. From an artery. Can't be far. Oh. Wouldn't have made it. She could, he could still be alive over there? Vile. All right. Let's see if we can, let's see if he's, there's anything left. Of this guy. Here we go. Look, 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 look. No, no, no. All right. Back to the fire spell. It's super effective. Fuck you. Ow. Rude. Do not appreciate one bit. Where are you going? Where are you going? Up. Oh. You're on fire now. I'm just gonna keep hitting you. And I don't know when I'm gonna stop. Ow. That was a surprisingly switch counterattack. Ow. Shit. Stop it. Uh oh. Stop it. It's not nice. Alright. A little bit of loot. Monster Tooth. 
That wasn't even part of the quest, was it? That was just kind of here. Oh, it there he is. Waited for help. It never came. That's felon for you. Missing merchant's letter. That's probably gonna explain what happened to him. Poor guy. He's just trying to make a living around here, and everyone's a dick. Volker. We've hit gold, old friend. Not only have we sold all our stock, we have sold it for three times its cost. Our customer awaits... wants it all. Wine from Beauclair. Everything from... Beauhole Nouveau to the oldest vintages. Uh, white, red, rosé, you name it. Uh, Cattoblops, meat, pickled beef, pe pepper, cinnamon, cloves. I'm telling you, old friend, everything. There's one catch, however. We must deliver the goods to Velen, to a village called Midcopes. I know. I know. Dangerous. Well, with the war and all. But think of the coin. I've managed to secure a pass that will get you across pon the Ponter. And that's j and then it's just a hop, skip, and jump, and you're there, and you'll be fine. Klaus, P.S. We'll split the proceeds 50-50. The guy that made the deal sent someone else to go? That's a dick move. You're not splitting much profits here, you're just kind of splitting his organs open all over the floor. A little less positive of a note to end things on. Alright, come on over here, Roach. We're off to talk to Kira again, whose order got someone killed. Yay, dead people. Roach, come on. I think the horse is my least favorite part of this game. It might be. It's, a. Uh, it's useful for its speed, but dear lord, is it like... It's awkward to control, it gets stuck a lot, and sometimes you're like, I can't get off it when I'm trying to get off it, and... It just, it's, it's something that doesn't control as well as it probably should for something that they probably want you to use all the time. Anyway, we're coming up on the mage building here again. Figure I might as well follow up on our quest line as much as I can until they out-level me or we run out. Just to be... Now. Just to be consistent about it before I move on to something else. Gives us a little bit more continuity while we're doing this. To do it all at once, I think. Geralt! Just when I was starting to miss you. Got those, uh, substances you wanted. Splendid. I can finally begin my study of double arboreal racination patterns. But first, I'll... Brew yourself a mug of mulled wine. Saw what the wagon was carrying. Exquisite meats, expensive wines, Zeracanian spices. Not a speck of magic. Care to tell me what you're up to? I would rather show you. But you must wait a bit. Color me intrigued. Fine, I'll wait. <laughs> then shoo, outside. Gonna slip into something more comfortable? Later. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Well, go on, out. You've been patient, thank you. It's almost ready. Huh? If I wanted to see white mice, I'd just get drunk. Note that I said almost. Now don't interrupt. The cane within capable. Third mouse, what happened to it? The spell has a 66.67% chance of success. I always use one more than I need, just in case. So where did... Kira, can I explain what's going on here? Know the fairy tale about Cinderella? Mm-hmm. True story it's based on, too. A zoogle cropped up in a palace pond and ate Princess Cinderella whole, left behind one slipper, so... I beg you, not another word about zoogles. Now to return to the fairy tale. I'd like to escape these ghastly swamps for one magical night. I don't need a fairy godmother, I'll cast the spells myself. But I could use a Prince Charming. It just so happens you're the only decent candidate in all Vellum. So, what do you say to a moonlight ride on horseback? And dinner? Sounds tempting. So tempting, I don't think I can refuse. Before we go, there's one more thing. Gotta transform a pumpkin into a carriage. 
No. I shall transform our rancid rags into something more glamorous. Don't wince. It'll only be an illusion, won't hurt a bit. And at dawn, everything will return to normal. Why not? Might as well go all out. Then hold on tight. Gvela Glan. So, what do you think? Neckline too modest? It's just right. Oh, I might also have changed your hair color while I was at it. I've always fancied dark-haired men. Oh well, any port in a storm. Well, off we go. Dinner's waiting. Last one there does the dishes. Yay, someone died so we could have a romantic night out. Hee <laughs> Oh, we're racing. Oh, I'm gonna wreck her shit. Get out of my way, lady. You don't know me. You don't know what I'm capable of. <laughs> oh, hard left. Here we go. It is definitely easier to watch the map than to actually look at the screen when you're doing this. Yep, she is not catching me. Although my horse is getting worn out. That might be with my downfall here. How close are we? How close are we? I don't actually know. Uh, gotta go slower to- Oh no, she's gonna pass me now. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Not letting the lady win. Not letting her win. She's gonna have to earn it. Oh god, I went off the path. Oh, I'm fucked. Whoa, Cinderella. We'll have a great fall. Well... Ah, uh, he's rested. He'll be fine. Come back here. Come on. It's not fair. Roach sucks. Why is your horse better than mine? Oh, I wore him out now. I'm fucked. I'm in trouble. Holy crap, her horse just keeps going. Oh wait, I'm not even on a roach. Never mind. I thought you were better horseman. For the record, I was riding a mouse. For someone who usually trots around on a roach, that shouldn't present a challenge. Now do you see why I needed those substances? Could have just told me what this was about, Rhino. <laughs> Geralt, run to the woods and fetch my shopping. I'd like to make dinner. Well, would you have helped? If I'd known I'd get a glass of Zubaran dry in return, of course. Well, well, never took you for a wine connoisseur. Think witchers suck the marrow out of drowner bones and wash it down with puddle water? More or less. Well, we've chatted long enough on empty stomachs. Let's dig in. Must have cost you a small fortune. Sure you don't need me to pitch in? Please, I manage. You know, a dozen eggs here, a cock or gander there. Besides, my finances are about to improve. All right, I'm curious. We celebrating something? Yes, a return to the living. But that's not what I wish to discuss. Thank you once again, Geralt, for your help with the tower. You were fabulous. Not the first curse I've lifted. But among the most difficult, correct? What happened on that island? Why I shiver at the thought. And the laboratory. I sincerely hope you burnt everything. The cages, the corpses, the papers. Didn't destroy that workshop if that's what you're asking. Didn't see any reason to. If Alexander's findings were to fall into the wrong hands. Although, Fikile has a terrible reputation. None even dare go there. Perhaps there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> I'm sorry. Such a gloomy subject to broach. I simply shouldn't have, not during our romantic dinner. Romantic? Thought we came here as friends. Friends. With benefits. So? Your fairy tale, your rules. Really? Then close your eyes and count to ten. One, two, three, four. All right, that's enough. Yennefer's gonna be pissed, and Kira, she's gone. Wanna play hide and seek? Why not? It's a trap! 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 Uh, what's that? Is that her? Perfume, I assume? Oh, that's her clothes. That's her clothes on the floor. A skirt? Guess we're playing hunt the hare, not hide and seek. Hang on, can I grab the clothes? I mean, the food? 
I mean, I don't want to start a forest fire. Still, though, I, I don't want to take all those all that food. Food's expensive in this game. All right. Good. Won't have to fumble with fasteners. Just a moment to pick a flower. <laughs> so romantic. Hmm. Shame. Could have kept her shoes on. Now her feet are all dirty. It's gross out here. She's gonna get all the poison ivy. Now where's that Cinderella gone to? And she was eaten by a wolf. The end. It was very tragic. Found me. Congratulations. Do I get a prize? I have nothing on me. But I'll think of something. Call that constellation in Zeracania? Dragon something, I bet. <laughs> no, it has a different name. A bit indecent, actually. Lean closer and I'll whisper it in your ear. Eggfain Navi. She's up to something. Uh, Fike Isle, the tower. Oh uh, no. What has she gone and done? Well. New carry, uh, character entry, uh, entry updated. Oh yeah. For the advancement of learning. We're going to have something interesting to follow up on next episode. Thanks for watching, guys, like always. I think this is a good stopping point. It's going to be fun editing a cat into that episode to censor the boobies. Oh, YouTube.